Greetings and welcome to exercise 14.1, creating a local user account. My name is Walt Weir with Johnson County Community College. Um, we've already logged in, click start. Computer management. Local user and groups. Click on users. Right click, click new user. Jay Smith, John Smith. Password is the same as we always use. Make sure you click that so it isn't don't have to change your password. Create and close. Now you see Jay Smith. Double click on him or you can go to properties. Either way, member of, you see he's a user. Click add. You want to make him an administrator click in here and like I always said try to do check name first make sure you spelled it right click OK apply okay and now you see it change oh you didn't see it change there um, right click J Smith and set password password click proceed please read this before you do it and you want to make it password one when you're doing this ensure you're not going to put any spaces in this it does matter click OK close computer management Click Start Setting. Scroll down a little bit. Click on the Accounts. Other Users. And you see Jay Smith is down there as Administrator. Lost where I was. Other users, log out of Windows 10, click Administrator, log out, click Other Users, and use Password 1. It's going to take a minute, so I'm going to pause it. And now with the, we're back in VC1, you logged in as this. Click Start, right click John Smith, change account settings. Start. Right click, change account settings. And you get right to the same place you were before. Um, you want to, where are we? Other users, London J. Smith is right here. Excuse me, where are we? Oh, sorry. John Smith, change account settings, sign in options. Sorry, I went to the wrong place. Sign in options and change password. You're prompted to put in password one. Click next. 
You want to change it back to the default password. Put in default. Next. Finish. And the pass you entered did not meet password policy requirements. Try one that looks. Okay, we didn't get it done. What they're trying to say is you got to do something else. You can't use that because it didn't make the minimum one. So we want to click start computer management. Local users and groups. Click on users. John Smith. Set the password. Read the little thing. And you want to notice they didn't come up with a password prompt here. And then we want to click the password that we do with default. Click OK. Sorry, I did something wrong here. Copy this out. I think I might have had the other one in there. Okay, password has been set. Close computer management. But we're only in six minutes into here. Let's look how long this one is. Yeah, we can do this too. So while logged into click start setting account, we're already here in account. So we go right there. Sign in options, we can do that already. Um, the pin, you want to go add. You want to put your favorite password. I just copied in there earlier. Okay. And then it asks you to add a pin. Of course, you're going to type in the box one, two, three, four, just like they ask. Confirm it. One, two, three, four. Click OK. Click start button, click settings, click account, sign in options. Oh, they want you to log out. I forgot to do that. Log out. Log out. Now that we're back here, you want to put your pin, one, two, three, four, and it welcomes you back in. It says, which is more secure, password or pin? Explain your answer. Click start. Settings. Accounts. Sign in options, remove. Now you're gonna to have to scroll down for this, but it says remove here. Anyway, it says here, you're having a pin makes it easier to make payments and connect your apps and server. Things like this, which is financially service. If you are using Windows, hello, to do your stuff, remove your pin. Anyway, it's neat to read those things. Um, verify your password. Again, this is um, 1234. Try that. And it didn't work, so I'm going to go back to password. Click OK. And now the pin's removed. Now we want to go to delete pin. Oh, there it says password. I just looked at the wrong place. Now we want to add a picture password, which is quite fun, I think. Click add. It says it wants you to choose a picture. Of course, we want to choose the most. Oh, sorry, password again. Okay. 
Okay. Choose picture. We're going to pick a picture that we like. Open. We get the pretty flowers here. Use this picture. Now what it wants to do is do three gestures. You can either do circle, straight line, or tap. So I'm going to circle this, start at this leaf, go to this leaf, I'm going to go to this one, this leaf right here, and go to this leaf and tap this. So let's just start. We're going to circle this. You want to take your time doing this and again start here drag it all the way over to here and then I want to tap this now I want to do it again circle start here go to this leaf and tap here and then click finish and that's how to set a picture Thank you for joining this class. I went a little bit over on this in 11 minutes. I would say remove it, but you guys can do that. Thank you.